I haven't even left yet and already the worst thing possible has just happened. I woke up this morning to a text from Ryan and here's what the message said. Hey dude, really sorry to drop this on you so late but I won't be able to come with you. It wasn't an easy decision mate and there was lots of factors involved. I know, I didn't expect it either. I just can't believe this is happening. I'm trying to find a plus side in all this but honestly I can't see it. It's still so raw. So now I'm literally calling around people that I trust to find me a companion basically. Uh, I just need someone there to help me be my guide, um, again to help with all these vlogs. Uh, and, and thankfully I've had a few people respond so uh, fingers crossed that all pulls through. Um, but I'll tell you what, this is not the day I was expecting. Well, vlogging's certainly harder when you've got one person. And here we go. Bye, there's my car. Awesome. So we've got a 10 minute drive to the airport, check in, and then I wait around for the flight. A very lonely, a very lonely 19 hour flight. So day one of the trip, we're on our way to uh, the departure lounge now at Birmingham Airport, and then we'll soon be off to Manila. Just at the airport now, um, at a place called All Bar One. Got myself a well-deserved Coke. My mouth is so dry. And I'm feeling a little lightheaded as well, so I could do with some food. So I'll probably grab something snacking. The trip took an interesting turn. As it turns out, because I'm on my own now, it means I've got a lot more weight in my luggage. So I had to pay extra uh, for the oversized, overweight luggage. This trip is off to an awful start, if I'm honest. But hopefully it'll get better as time goes on. So I'm just sat now at the gate, my gate number 44. Um, we're with Emirates and we start boarding in about... I don't know actually. In about an hour. Hopefully here on in the journey is going to be much better. And the experience will be much more positive. Uh, still feels a little weird just talking to camera out in public, but I'm sure I'll get used to it over the next week. Because um, let's be honest, a lot of people don't really care that I'm doing it. They just find it interesting that I'm doing something like this. I don't think the flight's full, so hopefully I'll have a chair spare next to me. So um, don't get me wrong, I'm quite happy to talk to people, but when you've got a long flight, I just like to be left alone. <laughs> I'm at Dubai Airport. Right now, chocolate is like the most amazing thing I've ever had. I got a little upset earlier because I was thinking about the last time I was in Dubai. Very happy to see a shot in the dark appearing up on the uh, entertainment here. There's about three hours left, I think, of the remaining flight into the Philippines.